This is how you make a bulldog pup cake. Add a thin layer of vanilla frosting on the top of the cupcake. Too much frosting on the cupcake will make it harder to decorate the puppy face. Once the caramels have been unwrapped, if they're not easy to roll out, just microwave them for a couple of seconds. Press the two caramels together and roll between the palms of your hand to shape them into a ball. Roll or press out the caramel into an eighth of an inch thickness on wax paper or parchment paper. Cut out a circle using a two to two and a half inch round cutter, reserving the excess for later use. Place the caramel circle on top of the cupcake to cover the entire surface. Using a knife or a teardrop shaped cutter, cut two small ears from the excess unused caramel. Place one ear at 11 o'clock and the other at one o'clock and fold them inward over the caramel circle that covers the cupcake. Fit a piping bag with a number 12 tip and fill it with vanilla frosting. Pipe a round disc the size of a quarter on the bottom of the frosted cupcake near the six o'clock position. This can also be done with a small spatula. Place two more caramels into the microwave for two to three seconds and press them together. Roll them in the palms of your hand to form a ball and then continue to roll them into a rope the length of the cupcake's diameter. Shape into a boomerang or a C and place it in an upside down position on the cupcake. Using another small piping bag filled with a dark chocolate, use the number two or three tip and pipe dots of the chocolate icing as the eyes. This can also be done with small sugar candies. Pipe eyebrows above the eyes. Pipe two teeth using the vanilla icing. Place a small brown or black candy on top of the rope for the nose. This can also be done with a jelly bean or by piping a little bit of frosting. Using a knife or a toothpick or a veining tool, form face wrinkles in the bulldog's face as well as on the mouth below the jowls. For more pupcake ideas, visit myrecipes.com.